Hey, my friends, welcome to the Lord Olympia. Now, before we get started, if your name is Mark Y, and uh, also if your name is, uh, he's not here anymore. Mark Y, can you message me, please? Since I, I have no way of contacting you. If you're this guy, can you message me? Please. Thank you. I'll be, I'll be very kind. Yeah, let's begin our Lord Olympia adventure. We're, we're reversing low tiers because, you know, we always do high tier videos. So, it's, you know, one of these days we'll low tier and show you guys the low tier group. So, this, you know, of course, I'm we're in respect if you guys want to join us, you know. But yeah, this is low tier at the moment. And uh, yeah, you're going to see the low tier master in action. But these guys are all going to be fancy. So, you kill them there. Activate the divine there. All the heroes should just be going out right now. And we should be able to take it. Like I said, we, we always see the high tier. Let's, you know, one time go for the low tier videos. Low tier attacks. So this is how we in the low tier, you know, actually deal with the attacks. I know I could have attacked a higher guild. But again, you want to make sure you get into the position you want to get into. So Lord Limpy, you want to go into Summit. So this is one way of doing it is to get into Summit like this. So you gotta, you gotta make sure you time. It's all about technique, you know, in this game mode. If you don't have the right technique, you know, you don't you don't get high up there in the rankings. So you, you gotta make sure you get the right technique going. So we get that going. Activate the Keeper Divine. Always gotta make sure you know where to activate Keeper Divines, all right? That's very important. You see, activate the Keeper Divine, get all that going in there. So that's excellent for me right there. I probably don't even have to use spells on this. But yeah, we talked to Guild that literally all their members are just one guy. Activated that there. It looks like the last Keeper Divine we're going to activate right here because uh, Keeper and X are here. And I'm going to have to activate the spells just to get them going. And then the last Keeper Divine I'm going to activate there. So that's where majority of it's going to be. So we got a minute 26 seconds and to take out this base. We should be able to take it out. I'm going to activate one more spell when we get close to that one right over here. And activate that one last spell here and I uh, should take care of that. That's gonna go out, and then last but not least, the victory statue is left there, and uh, yeah, I should take out that one too. Very simple and easy. If you have low guilds, and if, there's not much you can do, you gotta make sure you actually find guilds that are gonna be not too difficult for you to beat. So this is how it works out. Activate that, and I should be, I should be, I think I do too as well. Yeah, I got one of them. The other one should be left too. And yeah, that takes care of this. Somewhat easy player, you know, 38 seconds left. And again, if I had time to keep her divines incorrectly, it would have been a different story. I would probably lost that. So, always got to make sure you know you're doing it. Come on, just take this out already. Team. I put another spear on X, and, you know, he's still useless. Look at this guy. Really useless. But, yeah, we got rid of that guy. So, let's go ahead and take, a, take out two more of them. And, uh, yeah, so... If you're this guild, why do you have this, like, why is it just you? I'm curious. Why do you have so many accounts? Very curious on that. But let's go and uh, take out the next guy. So I'm pretty sure these two are the strongest. So for, for my teammate status, since he has 250 there. And this one shouldn't be that difficult. So 225. There's no high victory statues. Same thing with this guy as well. No high victory statues. They can just easily take this guy out. Let's go take out these two up here. That one and this one. And uh, hopefully our teammates can actually take out the rest. So I don't have to. You know. Be like what's going on again. Can you take out the Bastion? Good sir. Good sir. Good sir. There you go. 29. 250 keeper man. That is impressive. That is very impressive. They're still here on the phone. I keep thinking this is the Venom account. I keep like clicking Divines. Thinking it's going to go off. But it doesn't. It doesn't go off. Because it ain't the key. It ain't, it ain't the Venom account. Bam. Right, where's the next keyboard divine going to go off at? Uh, I see that's the highest reinforced right there. I can already tell. That's, that's the highest reinforced there. I'm going to save the last Keeper Divine for there. I'll activate it. Good. 
That is the highest victory right there. Oh, it looks like they're going exactly where I want them to go anyway, so that's cool. Get that situated. As soon as they get a little closer right over here, I'm going to activate that. We will take care of that. It's simple and easy. Yeah, this video is not enjoyable, I understand, but you have to always think about it. There's always the very high guilds you and then there's always the low guilds. You got you to have both of them. So I have to be keeper divine there. Should take care of that. Yeah. And the last keeper divine will have to be probably the alchemy right there. That's usually where the majority of the HP is at the end. The rest of the defense just goes out pretty fast. Alchemy is always where it's at. I could be wrong, but you never know. But again, you take out the stronghold, that's 50% of the, that goes out. You take out another key, about 10%. You take out another key, about 10%. So that's pretty much 70% of the base or HP wise you take out and uh, help out the guild. You can just take out this guy too. Like I didn't even get these spells in then. Excellent. That's uh, one way of doing that. And I'll take out the last guy. Our teammates have uh, easy going. Look at those victory statues. Look at the victory statues! I should break. I should break. I should break. You should have dropped the Bastion in the center. Bastion! There you go. Keeper Divine. Oh, there you go. It's saying it. I was like, it's not hitting it. Sad. Very, very sad. Keeper Divine is hitting it. And you got all three of the Keeper, I mean Bastions. Exact amount that I, and it's taking out the Stronghold too, like it's doing all of it. And how on earth are you still alive? What, 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 what is she made out of for it to stay alive that long? Keeper Divine! It's useless anyways. The race is going on. That was the biggest HP was this victory statue. It's nothing more. Everything else is pretty simple and easy to take out. Let's hear that, let's hear that, let's hear that. And last thing is going to be that. There you go. Nice, easy Lord Lumbi attack. Nothing too stressful like I usually handle. And my teammates, all I got to do is take out this, this one right here. It should be very simple and easy, literally. You just drop right here. Active pens scale, kill everybody. Really is like... Oh, it's got the right here aids on, but everything else, it doesn't really matter. It's going to go out anyways, so it's not a huge deal. Is the right here is on this one too? Oh, just the Ravager on that. Yeah, yeah and the key, they're, they're pretty simple and easy. Just those three were difficult, but yeah. Good luck to everybody in Lord Olympia, and hopefully you did enjoy this video, man. Stay uh, happy, my friends, and see you all next time.